how to charge your body by induction. The word induction is a combination of two words. An English word called induce and a Latin word called inductio. Combining them together gives you induction. Induction as a word has varying meanings depending on the context. For example, it could mean that the process of formally introducing you into an organization or in medicine it could mean the process of bringing a child birth by artificial means or in mathematics it could mean proving a theorem by showing that it is true and so on but for this video we look at induction in the physics context as simply the process of chain of charging a neutral body by the proximity of another charged body with the two not being in contact this is what we mean by charging a body by induction. It's Kisembo Academy. Thanks for tuning in. In the first case, we get to see how to charge a body positively by induction. And in our first diagram, we are having a body that is negatively charged. And we are having a conductor. This conductor is placed on top of uh, an, an insulator. So this insulated stand is holding a conductor as you can see this conductor has got both positive and negative charges so this conductor is neutral this is a negatively charged body so we get a negatively charged body we place it near a neutral conductor when a negatively charged body is brought near this conductor it means that this being negatively charged it will repel the negative charges and when these negative charges are repelled the positive charges are remain attracted here the negative charges are repelled away so while this conductor is still in the vicinity of this conductor while this charged body is still in the vicinity of this conductor we ground this conductor or we call it we earth the conductor and when we earth the conductor the negative charges are further repelled to the ground so when we break the earthing or when we break the ground we remove this and that at the same time you would find that most of the negative charges were repelled to the ground so the conductor remains predominantly positive it means that this has been positively charged by induction charging negatively by induction will do it like before when we get a positively charged body and we bring it in the proximity or in the vicinity of this neutral conductor these positive charges are going to attract those negative uh, negative charges so the negative charges will be attracted to this side of the conductor leaving this side with more positive charges so while this body is still in the vicinity of the conductor we earth the conductor when we earth the conductor negative charges are attracted from the earth into the conductor when they are attracted to the earth into the conductor you will find that this body now starts gaining more negative charges as compared to the positive charges that are already there so when you break this earthing and remove this charged body all at once you will find that you have gotten a body that is predominantly negatively charged and this is how we charge a body negatively by induction how to produce two opposite charges from one type of charge we are going to get two conductors and we are going to make sure they are in contact these two conductors are positioned on insulators so when we put a and b conductors we position them this is end a and end b we bring a positive charge like before we bring it in at the end near end a when we do so these positive charges are going to attract the negative charges that are within these negative charges will be attracted towards end a and so end b will be will have a net positive charge when this happens you separate these conductors while the charged body is still there it's still in position when you separate the two you'll find that conductor b has a predominantly positive charge and a is negatively charged and that is how we induce two opposite charges from using one type of charge now we should take note that in conductors it is only negative charges that flow 
Up next, we get to study about the electrophorus, a device that is used to produce an unlimited amount of charge. Please don't forget to comment below or hit that like button. Someone out there may like to watch this tutorial, don't forget to share. Otherwise, for more videos, simply subscribe to this channel for Kisembo Academy. This is Anold Ranga Kuramia.